Mark Ayet. Yeah, and really, that's one thing about the pass records are uh, totally meaningless uh, tonight because... So with that said, shouldn't the ball right now go through Chris Weber? And the Kings are on the scoreboard. I think uh, certainly the Kings can probably force double teams if they get the ball to Chris in that position. All right, Chris is again down low on the block. Again, it's Marion. No double team. There it is. I mean, that's your offense right there as long as the Suns are going to go one-on-one -on, -one on Weber. Yeah, they get a good look at uh, Chris Weber establishing himself in the uh, low post. Look, no double team, so Chris knows he's got room to operate, just back to the position he wants. And shoot. Brad Miller challenging Amari Stoudemire. Nice pass to Weber, and Chris Weber missed the reverse, stays with it. Weber with those good hands. Weber again. Chris Weber, and having a big first quarter with six points. Boy, Brad, Brad call. Now watch Chris Weber. Here he uh, misses the first one, but stays with it. He look, looks like Marion has the inside position, but those great, great hands of Weber and strong hands stays with it, uses a half hook, and knocks the second one down. Whitten Richardson missing his first three shots. Miller running the floor. Brad Miller in and out, Weber mops up, Weber again, Chris Weber taps it home. Pop loose, Chris Weber with a chance to score in double figures already if he makes both, that one gets the bounce, McDonald's in November 17th from 4 to 9 in the evening, call 916-928-0000 or visit kings.com. It's interesting to see how the Kings defend when they get to the other side of the floor, Weber, Chris Weber with a beautiful switch of the hands moves, Fourth deep left. And the Phoenix Suns were down five, and they now lead it by two. The two-point Phoenix lead, but Devoitis Webb looked active here in the first quarter. Certainly has established himself in low now. Look with the nice half hook over there and a great second effort basket by C. Webb, staying with it, using the good hands to make the finish. Now watch this up and under using the left hand. Gorgeous body control by C. Webb. The numbers. Joe Johnson in as well for the Phoenix Suns. Under a minute left here in the first. And a nice entry pass, and Weber mops up. Yep. Poked away by Weber. Turnover, the sixth of the game for Phoenix. Jake Foster started all last year. Really, we haven't yep. seen him yet. So. No, he's out. He has the flu, and he uh, is not dressing tonight. Stojakovic, another three. Page has made two straight threes, and boy, is that a welcome sight. That is so, is so much better as well. Uh, we saw Casey Jacobson have a real impact in that first half. All right, Weber, again, in a great position on Marion. Five feet away, Here's easy seven. shot. Easy. And it's on Weber, his third foul. A cheapie on Chris. Have we seen Chris Weber with that half? hook in the paint see catching the ball in deep on sean marion yeah they went in double teamed and uh, of course that became an illegal defense but that's something the kings can expect oh doug christie a three what? to watch uh, doug a tip back from uh, chris weber doug uh, doesn't hesitate has been struggling outside not that time and there uh, wasn't enough purple shirts back to help out game tied at 72. No double team, so Weber takes Marion, and he puts it up and in. You know, it's pretty obvious. If they're not going to double Chris, he's going to score every time on Sean Marion, pretty much. Yeah, I'd go at Steve Nash on the other end. Now, watch, uh, you see C. Webb against Marion, just rolling right into the lane at seven or eight feet. Now it's Christie hosting. And Chris Weber, that's his first perimeter shot in the ball game. Everything else is 10 on the shot clock. Sangala from Jackson. Oh, what a block by Hunter. Weber gets it back. Weber. And the Kings. Second chance points, 84 80 time. Now, what Darius bringing it in hard. Here's Stephen Hunter say, well, that's hard, but it's going back. But there again, Darius stayed with it, knocked it to C. Webb. C. Webb missed it, but he stayed with it. Let's see if they can finish it off here in the third. Over the years, when the Kings lead after three, they normally win their games. Biddy, good look, top of the key. Mike Biddy with 14th time. Now, watch uh, as Matt Barnes finds C. Webb in, in low. Now, you see the double team come, Casey Jacobson. Leaves Mike Bibby. Weber finds the right guy, and the right guy is Bibby. And Bibby finds the victor defending. Ted on the shot clock. Chris Weber has 24. Nash is cut off. Jacobson. Look at the steal. Weber, four on one the other way. Barnes, oh no. And also plays on the offensive board. Kings with a chance to once again put Phoenix down eight. Weber, yes, Chris Weber has 26. 
Now watch as Mike Bibby comes off Brad Miller's screen. And now Weber's screen goes up in the air. Looks like he's going to shoot and find C. Webb right at the elbow. Elbow shot for one year offense and execute. Make sure you get a good clean shot every time. Weber again with a big shot, and he's got that nasty, filthy look going, and that could be trouble for the Suns. Weber's got 28, and that elbow jumper. Now watch as Mike Bibby comes off C. Webb. Little pass back. There's Webb right at the top of the circle. Just right in the well. Now another little high fade as Webb, Webb just uh, fakes the screen and steps to the side. Little pick and pop kind of move. And uh, get... Marion. Marion. Tipno. Johnson. And the Kings get their first round win. Oh, boy.